and to our left is the mighty James River. Oh yeah. By far the largest river that we will be crossing, or that we have crossed so far. Yeah, by, by quite a margin. Yeah. Uh, over yonder, as they say in these parts, uh, is the longest footbridge on the AT. Pretty fun. Big river, oh my goodness. Yeah. All right, folks, doesn't get better than this. The longest footbridge on the AT. James River footbridge. Thank you, William Foot. What a lovely footbridge. Yes. It yeah. allows me to not take a ferry. Yeah. I'm glad we didn't have to ford the river. <laughs> oh. Cock up our packs. Oh gosh. Use the duck pack like a little raft to swim across. <laughs> oh. No, thank you, sir. It is 3.42 and we have made it to our shelter. It's 16 or so, so we're 16 today. But I want to be dry. Fortunately, we have friends. Fortunately or unfortunately. Let's see how it goes. Goodbye, James Hollow Shelter. Back on the trail. It's day 47. Alright. All of our stuff is wet from yesterday. Very wet. Gotta love putting wet clothes back on the hike in. Oh yes. But, just gotta do it. This makes everything better in the end. <laughs> apparently. <laughs> yeah, the uh... It's like 1,500 feet climb to start our day. Yep. Actually got up at our normal time. We're back on this first week. Left the old guys back in the shelter. Ha ha. Yes. That road's cool. Chance of rain for the next few days. Yeah. A good chance. Good chance of rain, unfortunately. So <sighs> it's just spring though. Yep. What's today? Wednesday? Yep. Alright. Make it a few more days. No. I might pick up a food drop tomorrow. Oh, yes. We're back on the trail. really enjoy how the mountains look like look in the morning there's the James River
Welcome to our office. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, I see ours. This is the one on the right, right? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Not that I saw a truck on the one on the left. Yeah. But I think the sure one on the down. right is probably the train tracks. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Okay, the and then there's the there's... yep to the right of that. I think there's a little something something. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's where we were yesterday. Yep. So where do we? Hmm. I stay on that little mountain over there. Yeah, in one of those little valleys right there. Yeah. Got the green coming in. Oh yeah. It's lovely. Oh, how lucky it is to have, have a clear day. Morning, Hugh. Think of that ridge. Back there, the tall ones where we were at yesterday, the day before yesterday. Yeah. Must be. Some kind of tower on top of it. Think we'll be able to see that one from far away? The FAA tower? Yeah. I don't know. There's something yeah. up there, though. It's gotta be it. Yeah. I think so. It's a long way away. It is. Yeah. So this is just madness and a little bit terrifying and very sad. Four-year-old, seven miles up this mountain in November. Not good. No. No, no, no. Another news, climb another mountain. Over. I don't know what he's doing, man. Come on, buddy. I think he just gave up. <laughs> Damn. What'd you do to the poor snail? I moved him off the trail so no one would step on him, man. Gary. Come on, buddy. Look at National Geographic. I just don't know what he's doing, man. Meow. Oh. Meow. Meow. Look at those eyes, though. Mm hmm. I don't think I've ever been seen a snail this big before. It's very exciting. See on the trail. <laughs> just it took him a year to get there, you bastard. Sorry. 
Oh, forest service. Let's measure everything in board feet. Why can't it just be a nice forest? Frustrating. 300 year chestnut oak. Hmm. 157 foot white pine. Forty inch, inch hemlock. Forty inch hemlock. That's pretty big. That's a pretty big. Is that a beach? Oh. Huh. Yes. Thank you, National Forest Service. I appreciate what you do, but not how you do it. <laughs>